This is one of the few dead malls I've seen where GNC didn't make it. Oh yeah, Hallmark's closing. Did you know that? Hallmark went out of business. I've been in there three times, maybe that's why. Mall's actually pretty busy. So here's another major development. Um, what you may call it. Uh, Victoria's Secret has left. This used to be a diamond store, and now it's another sports type of place. Back in 30 minutes, the sign says. The former Bonton entrance has been boarded up finally. Oh, sorry, Victoria's Secret uh, space is now calendars, games, and toys. That might just be a holiday thing. Probably. What was next to Torrid over here? As far as I'm concerned, McDonald's. <laughs> yeah, a long time ago. <laughs> used to be McDonald's. Still have the holiday decorations going on. Place after that, and I forget where it was after that. Spencer's Gifts. Looks like it's still here, although I don't know why it's the door a quarter of the way down. So this was a Sprint store, and now it's another T-Mobile. There's two T-Mobiles in this mall now. Amazing. <laughs> a second Fine Arts Society booth. Or maybe they just moved here, I don't know. A pop-up shop. This was Forever 21. And now it appears to be another pop-up sports place. That makes three, maybe four pop-up sports joints in this mall now. This Forever 21 uh, was only like two or three years old when it closed. Must have spent a fortune renovating. This actually used to be two or three spaces. Here's a cool little look into the past of the mall. This is the new tile that was installed around 98, 99. This is the original tile of the Oakdale Mall when it was built in the late 60s, early 70s. Pretty cool to see. Burlington Coat Factory. A candy shop over here. Some kind of coffee snack candy type of place going in. This used to be New York and Company. It is now a, it appears to be a closed arcade. This used to be some indoor bounce house type of joint. Um, Great Escape Adventures. Looks like a toy store or a calendar store. Kind of looks like puzzles though. Broome County Auto Mall. And this is the former entrance to Sears up here. Now with the new door added in. All right, this is the western side of the Oakdale Mall. Uh, more specifically, the former Sears building. Burlington's over there, which used to be Bradley's an Ice Age ago. There's not really a whole lot happening on this side quite yet. Um, I know the very, very front part of the building up there, at those doors right there, is the uh, Department of Social Services or something now. And I'm not sure what's moving into these doors over here. This is the former first floor of Sears right here. Yes, they did remove the escalators that used to be in here. I think there used to be an elevator they got rid of too. But yeah, this is the uh, former first floor of Sears.
here is the Sears side of the, well, this is the Oakdale Road side of uh, what used to be Sears. Half of the building is still under construction. Parking lot's a little torn up. And then the other half of this is now Beer Tree Brewing. I don't know if you can read the sign. It's called Factory by Beer Tree. Beautiful building. Sure to click subscribe down below give the video a thumbs up this is a 2020 end of 2020 update on the oakdale mall arguably worse than the last video i made well definitely worse